All right, it's just after daylight. Just met up with Kerry Wayne. We're running a little bit late this morning. Getting dressed with this old shoulder sling. Uh, took me a little longer, so Kerry Wayne had to wait on me. We pulled up to our first spot, and I'll spin the camera around. We're doing this in the truck because we're going to make a stand pretty close to here. You've been getting, what, coyotes and bobcats here? Mm -hmm. On a camera. So we know it's some, you know, possibility for either. I think what we're going to do is uh, we were talking about it driving in. I think just go in there and start out with cat stuff, run some prey stuff, maybe rabbit, bird. I got a new rabbit we may try. Uh, mess with them cats for a second and then maybe go to some vocals. It'd be nice to call a cat up. But I'll spin this camera around and show you what our plan is. And then we'll get out and ease that way. I didn't want to do any talking walking in. So, you look out here. If you can tell, you can see how that timber, that's a creek right there. We're just going to walk this SMZ in just a little ways. Should have a wind coming back right to left. So, we're going to walk in with that wind pretty much in our face. Find us an open spot. Sit down. See if Kerry Wayne can blast something. Old shotgun. About time too. I see he's that way for we we done wasted enough time this morning. See y'all in a minute. Hey, right here, right here, right here. Nice trap in front of you. It's black, whatever it is. Big hole. That's like it's coming in here. Yeah. 
the sun. The sun is completely blinding me. You smoke too big. I mean, as a giant. Look like a big old big sucker. I think that tree hit him just a little, a little bit too much. The camera's shining right in the color's terrible and everything. Man, I wish I just couldn't see. I knew I had it pointed right. I just well, I thought it was on him, but I think that tree's gonna have him. I was blinded by the sun, but I thought it was in that opening. I don't know though, he kept swapping. I just knew he was going to come right here. It's a big sucker, man. Everything was perfect till he got right there. That sun was shining right at the camera. You had that sun as a moon on you. Oh, it's, I mean, it's. You can't. The reason I told you to shoot is because I could see the call in the bottom of the frame, and I knew he was right over the top of it. But after you shot, I bet it's on there, man. Huh? I bet it's on there. Man. I think he's gonna be right on the edge, just looking at it. Apparently, he likes a new, a new rabbit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he likes that boar sow bump too. Huh? He likes that boar sow bump too. <laughs> <laughs> that turned him around. He was going to go downwind to that rabbit. Well, that ain't what we come in here for. <laughs> It'll work, though. It is. Uh, that may have been more fun than a, uh, that's a, big than a coyote or a cat. That's oh, a, yeah, that's, that's a big hog. I thought I saw teeth on him, but I ain't 100% sure. Could have been a stick. But we're going to walk over and give you all a better look at him. We uh we came in here with intentions of blind calling for a cat or a coat. We sat down and turned on a brand new rabbit sound, and we've had this happen every once in a while. We'll have a big boar hog come in on. I guess they're coming to try to eat it. But he uh he kind of got up here. We seen him go across, and he wanted to circle downwind in the thicket of that rabbit sound, so I kicked on a hog sound, which was boar sow bump, and uh, he turned around before he got downwind and ended up coming up here. It ain't gonna be the best footage right there at the end because it was thick and the sun got right in the eye of the camera. I couldn't tell if the hog was on there or not. I could see the call and knew the hog was behind the call, so I thought he was on there, but I think that tree may have, I think he's on there enough, y'all. Anyway, that's part of the woods deal. And wasn't a perfect setup with that sun popping out on us. But uh, anyway, we had to set up like that for the wind. We'll go over here and look at this hog and then go see if we can kill something somewhere else. You roll him up with them apex. <laughs> Telling you them things stomp. You shot him through some stuff and that's a big old hog. Yeah. I've Dropped him. Apex MFK two befores. We'll walk over here and take a look. <laughs> that way. Bet he wasn't a bar. Oh, I know it. Although I'm glad it ain't. It ain't like we're right by the dang truck. Red and black spotted hog. You thumped him. Big old boar hog. That sucker was. He was coming in there to eat rabbit and. Do a little boar sow bumping too. <laughs> he changed his mind on the snack and decided he'd go for some boar sow bump. Hold the things he hit up there. Smoke that sucker's head. Oh, they can't handle that apex. They got some bad stuff. Oh, it bloodied his head all up. And I hate no way that's drag that out. <laughs> yeah, we, I don't know, we come in here pretty good ways trying to find an open spot, and this was as open as it got. And it's still thick. If we'd have known it, I wish we'd have been sitting right here, because it's actually a pretty good little lane down through there. That'd been perfect for him, too, but hated to push any farther. Way it goes. Oh, he wear a dog out. He 
could wear your butt out. That too.